<laughs> Good boy. Look, can we go feed the ducks? Sure, I brought a little duck food just for that very reason. Found it. Thank you. Hey, duckies, it's lunch time. <laughs> She's teaching them to swim. <laughs> they walk in a line. Just like we do on school trips. <laughs> Poor baby. We'd better help him. Huh, that's strange. He's all dry. He swam and didn't get wet at all. I guess so, but he's completely dry. But how? I don't know, but I've got to know. How can a duck swim and not get wet? I've just got to know. <laughs> What's happening here? What can it mean? because his feathers are really thin. So when he shakes off, he dries really fast, especially when it's so hot. But he should be at least a little wet, just like Captain. That's true, Luna. I know. Let's go swimming while we think. Good idea, Jupiter. Let's do a quack aquatic experiment. Yay! The water's perfect. <laughs> Come on, guys. Look! What are they doing? Look at that. It looks like she's scratching an itch. Maybe they have mosquito bites. We're going to need to get a closer look. It looks like the water just sits on top of the feathers. Let me see, let me see. I wonder how they do that. Let's try and get closer and see. Okay, Clyde, are you sure you don't want to come swimming? <laughs> oh no, we scared them away. Luna, I could be a duck. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> That's a good duck. <laughs> but we still haven't figured out why they were itching and how they can swim without getting wet. But the ducks keep swimming away from us. Well then, let's make believe we're ducks. Then we can get really close to them. Yeah, should we do that with your finger? Hang on, Clyde. We're ducks! Let's go swim! Hey, hang on. I don't have my floaties. And I still don't want to get wet. <laughs> We're ducks now. Quack, quack. We don't get wet, and we don't need floaties. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. But I never swim without floaties. Hmm. Come on, Jupiter. Look how easy it is. Come on in. It really is easy. But when we go back, I'll use floaties, right, Luna? Oh, wow. It's like my body is a floaty. <laughs> See how easy it is? Luna, I'm not even wet. <laughs> Me neither. Our feathers don't let the water get in. <laughs> oh, there's oil on our feathers. I wonder what it's for. I know. Water and oil never mix. The oil must keep us from getting wet. 
and you can spread it on your feathers. Mm. <laughs> so that's what the ducks were doing with their beaks. Quack, quack. Come on, everybody. Stay close. Follow Mama. Quack, quack. Oh, are you guys alone? Quack, quack. Are you lost? Where's your mommy? Quack. What strange little ducklings. Isn't that brown one the ugly duckling? No, I'm the Clyde duckling. You'd better stick close to my family. It's a dangerous world for three little ducklings. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Miss Duck. You can call me Mama Duck. Quack. Now stay close to me so you don't get lost. Quack. Quack. <laughs> ducklings, everyone here? Five. Everyone's here. Quack. Oh, and the new ones. Six, seven, eight. Eight ducklings. Very well. Follow me. Quack, quack, quack. Where are we all going? We're following Mama. Quack. We can't lose her. She keeps us nice and safe. But we learn to follow our instincts. Quack, quack, quack. Time to dive. Quack. <laughs> How do those ducks dive down? And where are they? We're gonna get left behind. Ducklings, ducklings, where were you? I was so worried. Quack. We couldn't figure out how to dive. How did you do that? Quack, 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 quack. You just dive like this. You see? Luna! I got it! Ah. Just let the air out! <gasps> <laughs> no! You have to squeeze your feathers in to let out the air! How? Like this? Yeah! I did it! Yeah. <laughs> I'm still dry! Now I can go swimming without getting wet. How fun! Huh. This is the best experience ever! Mama Duck, we learned to dive too! <laughs> yeah, and it's so fun! <laughs> We're excellent swimmers, it's what we do! In ponds, lakes, and rivers too! Oh, yeah. 
Very nice. <laughs> oh, Captain, you sure do love swimming, huh? Hmm, I wonder how Captain learned to swim. And fish, who taught them to swim? Oh, so many questions. 